If you're struggling with unit conversions, this video is just perfect for you. Hi, my name is Carla. I'm a registered nurse, and we're going to be solving unit conversions the easy way using dimensional analysis. So the first problem says convert five milligrams to micrograms. So if you really struggle all the time with knowing, okay, am I dividing or am I multiplying by a thousand? This is the first thing that you need to do. Look at the steps. Step one is to write down what you're trying to solve for. So what are we trying to solve for? In this situation, we're trying to get micrograms. So I'm going to write equals micrograms. Step two is going to be to write down the unit conversions. What do I mean by that? I mean, if I'm trying to go from milligrams to micrograms, which unit formula is going to give me that? Well, if you think back to your unit conversions, which you should hopefully have memorized, you know that one milligram is the same as 1000 micrograms. So I'm going to go ahead and write that down. I know one milligram equals 1000 micrograms. So now knowing that I can go ahead and plug in that unit conversion based off of what I'm trying to solve for. So I'm trying to solve for micrograms. So using this unit conversion here, I'm going to plug that in, but I'm going to make sure that my micrograms are on the top. And that is your biggest hint. So I'm going to put 1000 micrograms over one milligram. Now, all I need to do is cancel out my milligrams. So what am I going to do? I'm going to use these five milligrams to cancel out by putting the five milligrams on the top. I can just go ahead and put that over one. Now I can actually cancel out my milligrams and the only unit I'm left with is micrograms, which is exactly what I need. So now I can go ahead and solve. So 1000 times five, my final answer will be 5,000 micrograms. That was easy. Okay, so if you're interested in looking at more videos like this, go ahead and check out my videos. If you're looking for private tutoring, go ahead and check out dominatenursing.com and I'll see you there.